Hey there, and welcome back to the Weeb Lounge. I am Nick, and in this character spotlight, well, if you watch the stream, you'll know I spent a lot of money getting this character, and I really didn't need to because I got a double on the next gotcha. It's Valentine's Day, she's a do. She didn't give me a present, but I am hungry for cookies. Now, when this character first came out and on Global, you guys, when she is finally introduced, it's definitely a character that you want to get. He is back then somewhat of a top tier PVE character, kind of, sort of. Uh, Arena, not so much, but when she shows up on Global, definitely a character you want to get. I didn't get her till really, really recently, unfortunately. Let's go ahead and get into her skills. This will kind of explain why. Skill number one, Cure Design. I think I kind of sort of got that right. I took a little liberties with it. It heals the character in the mid-ground with the lowest hit points, a medium amount, and a small technique point increase. Okay, that, that sounds kind of lackluster. But while her field is up, which her Union Burst puts out, I'll get to that in a bit, it will heal all characters a small amount and gives all allies a technique point increase. Okay, that gets a lot better with that field out. Now, this character is going to have, like, this field mechanic. When she does her Union Burst, she puts a little field out along with some other stuff. I'll get to that in just a second, but all of her skills are somewhat based off of that. Skill number two, Segment Heart Shot, I think. I hope. Single target damage attack and physical defense down debuff. If she uses this skill while the field is up, the damage increases and the debuff is significantly stronger. Okay. <laughs> the field the mechanic or whatever, you think that would be kind of a detriment, but apparently she can get that field out pretty quick, so it's not that bad. It's not ramp up, but for the first few seconds of the fight, it, she's not going to do much. And then all of a sudden, okay, she's doing something. So it's not that bad. EX skill increases her physical attack power. If you happen to have her at five stars, it greatly increases her physical attack power. Now let's get to that Union Burst. Union Burst Sweet Sanctuary deploys a field on the ground that increases physical attack power, physical crit chance, and a technique point increase. Okay, so not only she put this field out that gives a whole bunch of buffs, now all her skills are going to perform much better, and all the other characters are going to perform much better. So this is pretty much a pure support character, obviously, but... Yeah, I actually really like this character, even though I haven't really got much of a chance to use her. I just know that she's in a lot of different strategies, so there's that. She does not have a six star, but she's got a hat. And even though it's a hat, it says decoration heart. It's not a decoration heart, unless you, well, I guess you can call a hat a decoration. I'll go with it, whatever. It upgrades the Cure Design skill, the skill number one, so that it performs much better overall, but also adds a large physical attack power buff when the field's out. So basically just makes skill number one a little bit better, physical attack power along with it. No frills, no thrills, but definitely worth getting. So this character, I wanted to get her for the longest time. I finally got her, and now I don't have the resources to really push her. Thankfully, I have other characters that can do the job. Let's go ahead and farm a spear, which I don't think she's going to be able to accomplish. She might. She might. Depends on her attack or her base attack speed. She won't die because she has that, that heal and everything, but oof. All right, let's see if I can find her somewhat quick. I put them all at what? 103. There we go. 103. I know it's an odd level, but I did it on purpose so I could find her quicker because I cannot remember where all my characters are at and the levels they're at, so I just write it down. Oh, man. So she, she does have a couple of attacks. Uh, she has a few good buffs and everything. She doesn't really do much damage herself, obviously. She's all about buffing the other groups. But that's pretty much what you bring her along for. And I really can't wait till I can get the resources to build her back up even more and more and more. Because in boss fights and stuff, you know, she's going to be putting this field out and dance around cake and give me diabetes uh, again. So what's with diabetes today? I did a few different videos that I, I said diabetes. Diabetes. I'm not good at saying that. But that field right there, it actually expands a little bit further than what you see the the actual visual for. It, it's a it's a really big field. She stands mid ground. It covers the front characters easily. 
Until they start moving forward, then they can get out of the field. But she casts it quick enough to where she'll replace it at some point. And the other thing is, is I do believe if she can cast multiple ones, you know, get her ramped up, that the buffs stack. That's another thing that really bumps her up. Now, you're not going to see her in the arena. This is not an arena character. Don't take her in the arena because, we, you know, there's. It, you can kind of think of it as a little bit of a ramp up, like I mentioned earlier. But in arena, especially on the JP servers, there's no time to ramp up anymore. If you run across Ninan, you know why. Oh, but a lot of boss fights use her, any kind of fight that needs physical damage. You could actually probably just kind of wiggle her in there and she'll do a little bit of a heal, technique point increase, all the other buffs. I mean, she... Ends up being really good. What else is really good is if you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification button. And I, my segues suck. I don't think they're ever going to improve. I really don't. Maybe I'll take a course on it or something. I don't know. But this character is... She shows up in the very first Valentine's event, I believe. And when that does come around, she is a definite get. Make sure you save up some jewels. Be ready to get her. Because in any kind of physical group, she's going to be useful. Except for Arena, like I said, you don't want her in there. Boss fights, strategies, she will be a part of everything. This includes clan battles too, so keep that in mind. We'll see you in the next video.